Jumpa Vesterbro, Westbridge Christmas, episode 16, Baby Tilos, Borrowing a Baby. Thoughts? Another episode I love, though I will criticize the problematic aspects of it. Spoilers for these first 16 episodes, and let's dive right in. So, yeah, we open on Stuart singing about how you can diagnose stuff based on the smell of your own urine, which... Thank you for that. And yeah, it is kind of funny the the you know, so so yeah, it's like a, a geyser, the the beer, and he makes some, you know, at least one of them is fairly racist. The the geisha one. But yeah, it is kind of funny this thing about, you know, these words sounding the same. We get some more misogyny when he encounters Tulve. But yeah, the, the description of the date is is quite funny, though, again, sadly, some misogyny and such. But the, let's see, yeah, the thing about, you know, how, how did you get there? We took a cab. It was very funny. The cabbie ran after us for like five minutes. <laughs> because that's the thing, you know, the, the, the phrase is taking a cab, I mean, taking that means taking it away from someone else so yeah and the thing with you know oh we had some fun pushing people into the water and on is like you can't do that they'll drown it's like no there's ice most they'll break a knee <laughs> which it's like doesn't really make it i mean it means they won't i guess it doesn't necessarily even mean they won't die it depends on how hard they hit the ice and what part of the body they land on but just yeah and, and the thing about you know oh yeah Andy's awesome she can piss farther than I can but not quite as precise wow. and let's see yeah and and Greta comes in and she's being more like demanding you know the the and and yeah she mentioned you know you have to uh, clear the the ice. So you know, an old woman already fell over, and and Sue's like, "I'll be right on it. I'm gonna grab her purse before anyone else has a chance to." And it's like, you shouldn't steal, and you know that um, you you can't do that. And Danny's like, "Oh, you, it could, it honestly couldn't be easier to do that." And they bet on you know, oh, down there, like uh, yeah, I give her thirty minutes tops. I give her 45 minutes, let's bet a 50. <laughs> and let's see. Yeah, and, and Igor comes in ready to, to kill them. And I appreciate just before he stopped, he does manage to say, call them decadent, which is exactly the kind of thing an old world Russian would say about people in the West that he dislikes. And the, the yeah, and, and Greta stops the the you know Igor from the, you know he he you know she she like grabs him by the ear and and like throws him out and and has that line about you know what you think wood grows on trees okay it does but that doesn't mean it doesn't cost money and see. yeah and and she's you know she insults honest um Let's see, at, at first I, it sounded like it was his outfit. I guess it's both outfit, but also like his, his hair. And, uh, yeah, and, and says, you know, I'm, I'm leaving, but you, you two are going to take care of my, was it ne nephew, niece, something like that. And, and Danny's like, I don't know if I should be taking care of more babies. Last time I tried, it broke. <laughs> And, you know, and Anna's like, that was just a doll. Yeah, but it's the principle of the thing. And let's see. Yeah, and and um, Danny has finished the, the the snowy mountain, you know, he was making in, in Coke. And I wish, that, you know, there's a part where he's, like, moving his face over. And it's supposed to be that he's sniffing it, but you can clearly see that none of it is moving. And I, I wish that they just had him like move his face close to it, 
and you know had the noise and not show him you know moving his face like that would make it more convincing but yeah it is kind of funny and and he's like oh look I'm the abominable snowman <laughs> and yes that was an in intentional mispronunciation because he also mispronounces it in Danish and yeah and they're they're dealing with the the baby and you know yeah it's it's crying because that's, you know how you know the baby isn't broken yet and you know Anna says we you got yeah you know sometimes babies like it when you sing to them and he performs just a few words of something that is immediately like um like you you immediately know if you you know either listen to him on the radio or and listen to that part of the radio show or if you have the the album where the the yeah which i have mentioned before um gunet lille dengse or you know sleep well pookie or something like that you know and yeah that absolutely like there's a, a couple of things in the actual song that mean that it really doesn't make sense for anna to be singing it but like it is yeah other otherwise there there definitely are aspects of it that yeah it's you know if you've actually it might actually be on youtube i'll, I'll real quick um let's see um yeah yeah it's it's um and it's under let's see on this medicine topic i uh let's see is this like a legit okay i'm not 100 percent certain if the i mean i guess i feel like if if it wasn't okay they would have claimed it because he's got a bunch of different Honest Madison, including various songs from this exact advent calendar. So I'm guessing it's okay to listen to from there. Yeah, uh, you know, it's it's quite fun. It's uh, yeah. Um, let's see, and and yeah, you know, you don't want to tell Danny that it's okay for him to perform perform music if you don't want what happens next to happen. And it's it's one of my favorite. It's got some. It's one of my favorite songs, raps off the entire Advent calendar, and really in general, Honest Medicine. Uh, you know, some great lyrics. And let's see. Yeah, and you know it ends with the the baby crying, and Danny's like, "What does it only like crap, crappy music?" You know, it's just yeah, and and you know for those who don't know enough about movie magic and are watching this scene, movie magic love, and are watching this scene, and they're like, you know, okay, there's that's horrible. You shouldn't rap so aggressively right in the face of this little baby. They didn't notice that every time we see, like. He he is performing it when you see him and Anna, but when that happens, you're not seeing the baby. Every so often, it cuts to the baby, and you see like Enten, you know, in in the foreground, like you know, throwing gang signs and and like moving and such. I guarantee you, when they filmed it, when they filmed the baby, he was he was either maybe there was no sound at all, or maybe they were playing like a pleasant melody or something. They would not be like aggressively rapping in the face of the baby like that. That's one hundred percent against rules. For there's there's some very stringent rules as there should be for filming with actual babies. Let's see and yeah, uh, Anna describes what it's like, you know, after having a baby, and there's some really nasty misogyny in his description of what the yeah how the how the woman is after that which you know pays off in a in a later episode but it's still pretty messed up i do really it is very funny that you know he's like oh you know the baby needs a change and you know he gets the diaper and hands it to dane like hey, can you take this which is all you know that's like like on it incredibly naive really really optimistic guy. So you know of course danny's not actually gonna pay you know so it drops to the floor and it's just like 
I'm not sure one baby with one poop can produce that much crap. I'm not I'm not an expert. I I have I th I think I I think I babysat briefly once and then there was a court order against me doing it. No, seriously. I've I've barely babysat at all. But that does not look like there's you know, but yeah. Appreciate, you know, and it's a very effective gross out gag. It looks positively disgusting, even though in real life that's of course not actual human waste, you know. But but yeah, they, they do a good job. And and honestly, like, good thing it wasn't a bad one. <laughs> what is a bad one then? Like, holy crap. But yeah. And the the ending here does set up very nicely that Danny is really going to struggle with this thing of like being a father to an actual baby not a not one only made out of plastic <laughs>